All right, so this video is supposed to help you study the anatomical structure of the heart. So I am sitting in the dark right now just so I can record this for you guys. Hopefully it is helpful. Um, the way the video is going to be structured is I will point at a part of the heart and I will pause for you to say the name of that structure and you should try to follow along and say the structure out loud and this will help you study. Make sure you have the correct spelling for these structures as you know spelling does count on the quizzes and the tests. All right. So I have the heart oriented as it would be in your body. Um, so this would be the left side of the heart and this would be the right side of the heart. Remember, it's always from the perspective of the patient. Notice that this tip of the heart is slightly towards the left side of the body. So I'm going to point out a couple of external structures first. For example, here, go ahead and name the blunt end of the heart, apex, the two flaps, auricles, and we're going to go in the general order in which uh, deoxygenated would flow and then the oxygenated would flow. So for example, name, superior vena cava, name, inferior vena cava, name, right atrium, name, tricuspid valve, Name of cords, chordae tendinae, name of muscles, papillary muscles, name of chamber, right ventricle, name, pulmonary semilunar valve, Name, pulmonary trunk. Name, pulmonary arteries. The pulmonary artery right would go to the right lung. Left pulmonary artery would go to the left lung. Blood would return back to the heart. Name, pulmonary veins, name, left atrium, name, bicuspid valve, name, chordae tendinae, name, papillary muscles, name, left ventricle, name, aortic valve, name, aorta, and then we have the aortic arch and descending aorta. Some other external features. Notice the aorta has this artery coming out of it here and on the other side behind the pulmonary trunk another artery comes out here name these that would be the right and left coronary arteries and then we have these here the blue ones go ahead and name those they actually lead back here, 
these would be the coronary veins.